what looks, what have we got in the tree? Is it a little goshawk or is it a lizard buzzard? Let's see. Let's see, maybe a gabar goshawk that's in there. Well spotted. Who have you got? Face yourself. Now this one is not particularly large. It's much smaller. It is, is it a little, what have we got here? Who have we got? I'm going to have to get out my bird app here because for some bizarre reason I can't identify birds anymore. I've forgotten. Maybe it's a little gabar goshawk. It's not big enough to be a dark chanting. It's actually quite it's small. Maybe it is a dark chanting. Maybe it's just the angle at which we're looking. Right. Let me get my bird app out. I need a little bit of help this morning. But perhaps some of you have spotted this already. Hashtag Safari Live if you know which goshawk this is. Definitely is a little goshawk. E no. I don't know. Who you are? Who are you? It's not big. It's quite small. It's bigger than a lizard buzzard. It's something in between. Let me check Gabar. Sort of around that size. Gabar. Yes, I think that's what. Where are we? Though? The legs are a little bit orange, aren't they? But it's the right size. It is most certainly the right size. It's sort of something in between a lizard buzzard and also a dark chanting goshawk. I think that's going to be my answer. I'm going to go with Gabar. What is it? Is everyone agreeing with me, Megan? Or am I completely wrong? Hello? <laughs> I don't know. And there it goes. But definitely had the bar. What does Ellie think it is? A lizard buzzard. It was so small. Ellie thinks it's a lizard buzzard. Maybe. Let me. Let's check here. Let me have a look. Let's go. It was just. It was too big for me to be a lizard buzzard. Let me just check. I want to see if, it, if we've got pictures of it flying. Yeah. It was. It was. It was about probably about this size. So not quite the size of a. Oh, I'd say probably a dark chanting goshawk must be about that tall. A lizard buzzard is quite small. They're very dainty little things. This was something in between. Let me just very quickly, I just want to see who's got the white uh, rump on it. The white little patch. Let's see here. Gabar goshawk. I don't know. It just looked, it looked around that size. It looked like something more that size than... And you see it had a very white rump. I don't know if you can see that. Can you see that? Or was it a, it's a bit difficult. There we go. There we go. But there's a there's quite a white patch over there, and I definitely saw that as it flew away. I'm going to go with Gabar Goshawk. That's going to be my guess, just because of the sun. And this is a nice look at the throat. I didn't see the front of the bird all very well. Maybe you got some... Let's go... Oh, what about a Shikra? No, it wasn't a Shikra. Let's go, Lizard Buzzard. I didn't, did you see the little stripe? I didn't see the black throat stripe on that bird at all. Mm -hmm. Did you see it? Maybe it was a lizard buzzard. I don't know, it was a bit difficult to tell, but it just looked a little bit too, I'm scrolling here, as you can see, probably all getting a bit dizzy. Let's see the size difference. I don't know, I don't know what it was. Maybe a lizard buzzard. Ellie's probably right. I've been out of the bush for too long. I've forgotten what these raptors look like. We used to have lizard buzzards living outside the Shavambalana Earth Lodge accommodation. And um, and see them all the time. But other than that, I haven't really seen too many raptors. There's that dark chanting goshawk that lives down at Cheetah Plains that we see every now and then. But other